Uh, Bravo and Kamara have combined for 25 goals this year, more than half of the team's total. Well, Stevenson and Wondolowski up front have done most of the goal scoring for this team. John Bush has probably been their MVP. Quakes in the black, in the powder blue, sporting Kansas City and sporting KC, a red hot team. We are ready for MLS action. Sporting KC will open with the ball in the light blues and another week underway. Prize that he's become a somewhat premier goal scorer on a high scoring team. Uh oh, tough play. Well done by Steven Bainesure to save a goal. Outstanding effort. Let's see that last play again. That was some finish. I'll tell you why it worked so well. Bainesure saw it. He used his speed to make up the difference, and he ran to the ball. He didn't run after Bravo. He ran to the ball, and he was patient enough. He waited for the ball to be in a position that he could play. See that one last bounce. He didn't get ahead of himself, and he waited. He knew that Burling was going to hold off. Um, bravo. See? Boom. There he is. Nice work by a kid who's uh, making his just his 16th start this year. Bunbury. 6-5 Burling there. Short siding it. And a clever play by Bush. And a clever play by Bunbury. That was yeah. a nice strike. Boy, he let it rip, too. He didn't have a lot of space, but he gave it a try. Yeah, nice strike in a nice place. I don't think you can underrate the play on both of those guys. Bunbury did what he was supposed to. He turned on Burling, got himself in position, struck it. It was headed inside that post, but right there, Bush to make the play. Well, that's why Romero went very happy. Now the build-up for Sporting KC. Left foot try blocked. Bunbury, a shove of Baca to possess. Oh, ball loose. Oh, and an open chance just outside the six. <laughs> and a miss. Lucky, lucky, lucky here. Bravo. Gets around Betasher, but Betasher does a nice job to block the ball, goes straight up in the air. But now Burling and Hernandez. <sighs> Thank you very much, Omar. Nielsen. The extent of his exercises right there. Ball loose. Bunbury cuts it back. What a stop by Bush. Brilliant by both players. Well, John Bush gets a save on this play, and Kansas City gets a corner kick out of it until Bunbury gets a swing and a miss. He gets it, takes advantage here. Should have taken advantage. Alia, he beats Burling, and he just has to drive that ball past Bush up and behind him. End of the match in first place in the East, and yet they by no means have it wrapped up. Well, they got lucky in that New York tied, so they couldn't move up. Um, Houston tied. Houston did pick up a point. Ball sent in. That's through! A goal! Chris Wondolowski! A huge goal in traffic! Now all alone is the number two goal scorer in Earthquake's history. And what a strike it was! And something that's been all too rare for this team this year, it's that late dramatic goal. Wondolowski, a dozen goals this year and probably a dozen other great chances to score. And he gets the ball right on his foot. And guess who the assist is? Half a dozen of those for Steven Betasher. And right back! We told you about the quick strike ability. That's how quickly. That lead is gone. Teal Bunbury. Berries won. Well, you can't stand around and watch the video board on a goal that scores. They started, they restarted very quickly. And they got the ball down the field in a hurry. Four, five, six earthquakes with a chance, and they're just standing around watching the game. They're just standing around watching Bunbury run down the field and score a goal. And how about this? The one time he doesn't go short side, he is sporting 
KC with a classic counter. Look at Mara running. Uh oh, Susi! And a leg up by Hernandez as he was down. He was offside anyway. Thunberry would have been called offside. And play continues. Not offside this time, and he strikes just wide. Goal kick and a minimum of two minutes of stoppage time added to this match. Some acrobatic play, but how did Jason Hernandez go down? Was it a shove or just feet getting tangled? It's hard to tell, but it looked like he just slipped. Controls for Beta Shore. And that will do it. The whistle blown. This game is over, according to Alex Bruce and for the Earthquakes. For seconds, they thought they had a win. But seconds later, it changed on a goal by Teal Bunbury tonight.